The preparation for our first flight uh, in a new uh, fighter jet is uh, fairly long. It's several years actually. Uh, it starts out in uh, simulators and rigs where you test the system, the robustness of the system. And for me personally, uh, I've been involved for that, in that for a long time now. Uh, and it's a lot about learning how the system works and how the fighter, the different systems inside a fighter. Uh, and for me as a test pilot, the important part is to have a mental preparation for whatever could happen up there. When we have a complicated uh, test that we want to do in the aircraft, uh, I normally draw a picture uh, on a test card and um, before the flight, uh, I close my eyes and I, uh, and I get tension on in the muscles that uh, have to do the sequence specifically and to get the timing. Uh, so then when I'm up flying, I just look at the picture and the brain knows exactly what it's supposed to do and sends the correct signals to the correct muscles. The, uh, well, uh, I can only imagine right now the feelings uh, when um, when taxiing out, uh, line up on the runway, hold the brakes, uh, spool up the engine and, uh, and get the thrust on and then uh, releasing the brakes, feel the acceleration throughout the runway, pulling back on the stick, letting the nose come up uh, and just feel the aircraft taking off, leaving ground and, and the, the proudness uh, and the uh, and what this team have accomplished uh, to get this new fighter airborne. Uh, that will, well, I'm getting goosebumps right now just talking about it. Really great.